Hello there folks, this is Uncle Troy. This is pretty much the pilot episode of a new series. Uh, it's a playthrough of the free open source game Open Arena. Open Arena is a uh, attempt to recreate Quake 3 Arena. It's software uh, released the source code uh, which allows anyone to, to compile the game. However, they did not release all the player models or levels or skins or whatever, so fans have been trying to recreate those from scratch to create a free version of the game. Uh, so uh, I've really enjoyed playing this game a lot. In fact, the uh, very first video I ever uploaded to YouTube was a video about Open Arena. And in fact, the only reason I sought out and created an account with YouTube was that I wanted a place to upload my video about Open Arena. So, five years later, I'm making my second Open Arena video, so thumbs up to me. Anyway, uh, I hope you enjoy this, uh, this uh, video of this uh, game. Uh, one thing I do need to stress, uh, the game is not exactly kid-friendly. There's a lot of violence in it, there's a lot of uh, blood and guts, and some of the player models are a little overly realistic, or unrealistic in a certain way. Uh, so if you're 17 or younger, uh, you need to get permission from your parents before you watch this series. Uh, I'll wait here for a second uh, while you go get permission. Okay, now that everybody has permission, let's enjoy the show. Okay, folks, Uncle Troy here playing the Open Arena Oh, single-player campaign. I've not played this in a long time. All right, we start out on Tier 1 where we have can choose any of these uh, missions and after we defeated up en enough of these we're allowed to go up to uh, tier 2 currently access the night. Uh, I have set my player skin as the uh, gargoyle with the tech uh, skin he's all lit up and shiny. Uh, I go by the name Catfish because uh, back when I first found uh, this game Catfish was what I was using for online gaming. Uh, there's a story to go with that name I'll tell you later. So in this first level, uh, we go up against a Yumi and Jenna, and once again, video games are a very, very bad influence on me. Minecraft taught me how to be cruel to animals. Uh, open Arena taught me that it is acceptable to shoot teenage girls. All right, we're gonna fight now. We have difficulty levels here. Uh, I can win is kind of the beginner level. Bring it on is kind of medium. Hurt me plenty is kind of hard mode. But then we go up to Hardcore and Nightmare Modes, which, uh, which uh, cause an alarm to go off when you select them. Now, I've never played these for more than a few seconds because I immediately start losing. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start on my standard Bring It On level. I have to turn that off somehow. There we go, we stopped. All right, I'm going to start off on my regular bring it on level. And if I win, when I play the next mission, I'll go up one. Say, hurt me plenty. If I lose, I will drop back down to I can win and replay the game until I win. But we're going to start off on bring it on. So let's start the game here. All right, start off with the shotgun. Not my favorite weapon, but I'll uh, use it. Pick up our armor and our health uh, power-ups here. The uh, little ammo here. The gold ones here. Oops. And I have lost the lead. And as you can see, we've got the leaderboard here. Uh, shows you uh, uh, who's in charge, basically. And as you can see, I'm at the bottom of the pack. So let's uh, respawn. Ah, rocket launcher. Now these I can use. So I'll get down here and see if we can't find us some victims. Yes. Okay. Good, good, good. Oops. I missed. As you see, when you pick up uh, discarded weapons, you get ammo. You can also get ammo by... Uh, I hit you head on. She must have had armor. Down here is a good source of armor and health and a rocket launcher. 
wait for this armor to come back. As I was trying to say before I was so uh, rudely interrupted, the uh, gold health, you can only pick it up if you have less than 100 health total. While I was talking to you, I let her get my armor. Okay, no more Mr. Nice Guy. It is time to spam some grenades. Or get blown up by a rocket. Okay, crouching makes you uh, smaller and harder to hit. And down here is the secret uh, heavy duty armor. Ha ha. All right, let's pick up our. Oops. Did not mean to uh, fall off the corner there. All right, not doing very good at this at all. Where's me some health? There's me some health. Oops, out of, uh, out of rockets. Come on, come on, trip on a grenade, trip on a grenade. And out of grenades. Okay, back to shotgun. Each weapon has its own uh, unique abilities. For example, the grenade can bounce around corners. The uh, rocket launcher travels long distances, does a lot of splash damage. Railgun fires a projectile at very nearly the speed of light. Lightning gun. With the lightning gun, you can sign your name. And it's not very useful as a weapon, at least not to me, because it doesn't do much uh, damage. She died there mostly from splash damage from her own rocket. All right, a little more. Pick up the health. There's the health. hit her a couple times. She must be. There we go. Tied for the lead. Aha. Take that. Okay. That was worth it. Just fire a few of these out here for no reason. Woo hoo hoo. Taking the lead. Tied for the lead. Taking the front. Come on, Jenna. Come on, come on, come on, and dang it. Alright, there we go. When you can't hit them head on, you can try aiming for their feet and hope the splash damage takes it out. Unfortunately, if you aim too low, then they don't take any damage either. Alright, I saw them go this way. Aha. And that is what the young kids call cheating, because I actually use some kind of strategy. I don't just run around aimlessly firing. But I know if she went that way, she might come out over here. Oops. Behind me there. Ah, she got me. Rocket launcher, health, armor, and we're back in good shape. Ha ha ha. Good being a relative term. Let her get away and then run down here and get this armor again. 100 points of armor means I can probably take a rocket to the face right now. Which is good because I will probably take a rocket to the face anytime now.
Where are you? Where are you? When I play this uh, game outside of the standard uh, standard standard campaign, what I'm trying to say, I will often play it with a lot more uh, bots than this. Because only, only having three tends to not give me enough targets. Hello, Jenna. Ah, dang it. While I was trying to get Jenna, uh, Yumi come up behind me, I got distracted. Anything else? Any, uh, oops. You are tied for me. Yes. Oops. Better get out of here before I start start drowning. Ah, yeah, yeah, there we go. Up and out. I keep forgetting I've uh, remapped the controls. Yes, it is unsporting to shoot somebody in the back of the head while they're fighting somebody else. If you want uh, a sporting game, oops, hello, Ayumi. All right, starting to get serious now. Because I have 12 of 15 frags. See, I heard the little hit beep, so I knew I, I damaged somebody there. All right, Ayumi. Uwa, take a bow. Yes. Okay, that's how you play level one. Uh, please leave your comments in the comment section below. Hit the like button for me. And if you want to see more uh, videos like Open Arena, uh, please subscribe. In the meantime, this is Uncle Troy signing off. Please have a good night.